Hello guys, Keep Arts on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into today's video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And yeah, and if you have been a Blues fan watching the videos the past 28 days, what are you waiting for? We're currently on 2,673 subscribers, only 27 away from 2,700. So yeah, let's see if we can get that done by the next day or two. So yeah, if you haven't uh, dropped a sub and you're a Blues fan watching the videos, I'll say it again, make sure to smash that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any Blues news regarding the takeover and also transfer news will be uploading daily as well. So getting into today's video, we've got an update about Tahith Chong. So Blues Chief would be disappointed to lose winger Chong amid reports of Luton Town interest. Of course, he didn't attend. Um, well, he wasn't actually on the bench. He didn't start, wasn't on the bench for the game against Solihull Moors, but now he hasn't attended the pre-season trip to Spain as well. Um, Birmingham City boss John Eustace, uh, John Eustace will be disappointed to see winger Tahith Chong leave St. Uh, Andrews during the summer transfer window following, following reports of some serious interest from Luton Town. Um, the 23-year-old is, is one of a number of players who are rumoured to be on the Hatters' wish list following their promotion to the Premier League last term. Um, with manager Rob Edwards keen to bolster his squad for the upcoming campaign. Now, um, he moved to, uh, we don't have to read, uh, with Birmingham shelling out uh, 1.5 million to sign Chong permanently, he featured 41 times scoring four goals but hasn't attended the club's pre-season pre -season tour of Spain, further fueling the speculation that he could be about to depart. Speaking to the Birmingham, uh, speaking to the Birmingham Mail about the possibility, uh, Eustace said, I'll be disappointed to lose him. We saw Tahith's development throughout the season. We spoke about all the players coming in and how, and how it is my job to develop them and move them on. In the year that he's been with us, you can see that, he, uh, that his performances were getting better and better. He matured as a player. To lose him wouldn't be ideal but it's part of what we do. We want to make players better, and if we are not successful moving up the league, we want the players to have the opportunity to get into the Premier League. If that happens, then great, but hopefully we can keep him. So my um, thoughts on the Tahith Ch uh, Chong situation. Look, I think there's more to it than we think. I actually do think he wants to move. I actually Look, Luton Town, Premier League club, I know they might not survive next season, but... I mean, the law of the Premier League is a hard thing to turn down, isn't it? Especially when, yes, we've got a takeover. Yes, it's a new era of Blues, but there's no guarantees. There is no guarantees that Blues will get promoted next season or the season after. I know I said we will get promoted in May 2025, but there's no guarantee. There's no guarantee in football. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens. Of course, um, Keshi Anderson done well against Sol uh, Solihull Moors. He's on trial with Blues. Is that going to be the Tahith Chong replacement? Can Keshi Anderson uh, replace Tahith Chong next season in the starting eleven? That's a difficult question. I, I don't. I can't see it really. To be fair, Chong done brilliant last season, in my opinion. Yes, he might not have got a lot of goals, but you know he contributed a lot to the team and um, got. A, about 11 or I don't know how many assists, but I think it was like 8, 9 assists, sorry. But yeah, Tahith Chung, will he leave? Will he be joining Luton Town in the next couple of days? It's going to be very interesting to see what happens. Anyway, it's been Keep On on TV. Here, make sure to like, share and also subscribe to the channel. As I said, we're only 27 subscribers away from 2,700. So if you're a Blues fan watching, been watching the videos, smash the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? And uh, yeah, let me know in the comments down below. So Heath Chong to Luton Town, will it happen? Won't it happen? And also, as well, do you think that um, a move to Luton Town is a good move for Chong? Anyway, thanks for watching as always. Keep your time.